So what you got coming? You got an album coming out? You got a new album coming? I have coming? an EP coming. <laughs> it is called God Silk. Koala Beats producing the whole thing? Koala. Is yeah. Whole thing. It's only four tracks okay. on this <clears> one. <throat> um, it's followed with another one. I'm not going to tell you the title of the other one. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It's already titled. Everything, I'm telling you, a plan. It's a whole marketing strategy yeah. coming with this. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I would love to tell people, but I just wanted to roll out. And y'all be like, dang, I see why she took her time. Yeah. But um, Koala produced every track on this one. God Soup came from a poem where I say in... Um, Every time I want to tell people this side, it's it was a flip on gossip. Mm-hmm. I'm a public prophet. Damn, I can't even tell you the uh, the line, but it came from a line from mm-hmm. a poem where mm-hmm. I um. Nothing like the gospel, but still have you gossip. Mm-hmm. I'm the poetic prophet, only gaining from her losses, and um. Basically, like, it's a triple entendre, could be a quadruple, depending on your beliefs or whatever. So, of course, gossip, but you gossiping about God. Everything you hear me talk about, even if you feel like it's negative, really pay attention because, like you said, life going to take you through trials. You're going to go through the good, bad, ugly, and the ugly year to get to the beauty of it. So, therefore, you're going to gossip about God regardless with me. That's what I'm talking about. I'm not out here talking about shaking ass. And if I do talk about something that make you want to move good, you should want to move your body, you know? But also, like, um, teeth. So, you know, if you ever pay attention to me, I'm always doing teeth. And you see how I say, get your teeth cup, yeah. put it up, and let yeah. God fill it up. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Then um, I consider myself, we are the, the image of God. You know what I'm saying? So, talk, God, talk, sip. Talk. you listening to me, talk, you talking talk. about me, God. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Yeah. that's what it's yeah. about. Yeah. And, um, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Thank you. That's fine. I look for it. It was going to be called Take a Sip because my poetry book that I released a couple of years ago was called um, Warning Sip of Caution. Yeah. And so I was trying to like take a sip or something like that. But then I was like, God, sip, that just hit better. It's a whole It's a whole everything. I'm telling you, wait until I'm telling you, wait until Fire. I drop it. You're going to be like, damn. And then not only that, you know, I make tea. I, you know, I make the sea moss juices. I make teas. I stopped for a minute, but I've been rebranding because of the projects. You know what I'm saying? So it's all coming together. It used to be Jamaican, me crazy sea moss, and I just did not. And my friends told me it was corny. I felt like it was corny, but then I was like, nah, y'all gotta see that. So let me tell you something. So, so it's about to be. So when you, when all that was going on, and you was able to just sit and be still. Is this, is this when all this started coming together? See what I'm trying to tell you. I'm telling you. <laughs> one day, okay, so one day I was just sitting in the room. I was in my feelings. And then I rolled. I literally, like, it just hit me. I rolled. I was like, oh, my God. God dropped everything in your lap, and you still ain't seen it yet. Mm-hmm. And I just went to write, and I was writing for, like, an hour. Every plan, every idea. Most of it was me just, God, thank you for this. Thank mm-hmm. you. Thank you. Thank you. Like, even mm-hmm. if I said every other mm-hmm. line, thank mm-hmm. you. Mm-hmm. You dropped the inside. God gave me the plan. <laughs> I got to shout him out. I'm telling you, like, yeah. oh, I cannot wait to yeah. roll everything. Like, I can't hold water for shit. Yeah. And I can't wait for y'all. Like, I'm really been trying to hold it in. Like, I used to over speak all the time about everything I want to do when heaven that was my ego trying to prove because so many people made me feel like I wasn't shit. And so now it's like, well, I'm going to be quiet a little bit, but I'm going to still talk my shit. And then y'all going to see how I go. And people still going to have something to say. So it's just oh, like, yeah, let it, it kinda, go. Kind of come with it. Yeah. Come with it. But hey, I. You, I am the shit, God damn it. You know what I'm saying? You gotta walk in it. Gotta walk in it. I want to ask you this, man, because you a poet as well, too. Mm-hmm. So I want to ask you, um, which came first? Poetry. Poetry. I literally uh, started poetry, like, I guess it's six years now. I started six years ago um, after a really bad breakup. Every poem was the nigga ain't shit poem. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, <laughs> and I would drop my poem like I would just record myself. I used to do security overnight, and I would post videos. <laughs> if somebody ever find these videos on Facebook or whatever, shout out to you because I think I tried to delete all that shit. But um, I used to just post videos of me trying to do the poetry to beats and stuff like that, and um. Somebody was like, "Hey, I'm doing a talent show. You should come perform," and. I had to go find some shoes all the way in the woodlands coming from Channel View. And I got in a car accident going to get the shoes. And at that moment I knew I'm supposed to be a, I'm supposed to be doing these. And a lot of people, how you get that? Because every time I try to do something great for myself, something try to throw me off track. And it was like, I'm not gonna stop. 
And every time I try to level up, here comes some shit. But it just make me better. But you remember, we, it's not trying to stop you. It be, it be, it be God, it be, it be, it be God trying to get your attention. Hey, that too. Yeah, well, that yeah. Just let me let me just sit you let me sit you down for a minute. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and now I was rushing. I remember getting irritated trying to cross over the median, and. That's how I got in a wreck last year, trying to cross over the median. But this time, I was trying to switch uh, over lanes when I wasn't supposed to be switching over lanes. I wasn't even supposed to be going to do what I was supposed to be going to do. Right, I had just right, saw, right, said I'm going to stop right, doing it. Right. And see, there are no saying? accidents in life. No accidents. Yeah. Everything happened. Lessons. Happen. Lessons. It was a lesson. Yes. So yeah. look, man. I'll, hey. Y'all stay tuned. Because I can't wait to hear the second song from Queen Me, right? So we're gonna play a uh take a quick commercial break and when we come back we got some more artists performing tonight. So look here, man. This is the artist access. access. And your access has now been granted. Aye. Yeah.